Well, hello everyone. What is going on? It is the Armati Chef, and we're here in episode 22 of Grand Theft Auto Vice City. In the previous episode, we completed the final two assassination missions in the game. We completed the two missions for Phil Cassidy. We then spoke to Love Fist and did their first mission. And then we started to, started uh, the missions for the biker gang uh, led by Big Mitch. So we did the first two missions of that. Now, as I've said in all of my other series, and I'm just going to do it in this series as well, the reason why I've been away for um, just a little while is because I had an illness for the week that I was off, coincidentally, and then I had a lot of work to do for college and all that. So I'm not going to go into any rambling details. We are just going to carry straight on with what we were doing before, which is just the missions, which is all we have left. Aside from the one shop robbery, which I think very soon we should be able to do, because I think... If not this episode, the next episode we will start working for Umberto, who is the guy who has the missions down where that shop robbery is. Uh, so yeah, so we're going to start by completing the final mission for Big Mitch, which is Hogtide. So let's go ahead and do it. Hey there, Mitch. Well, if it ain't badass for Seti. Now I want to see how good you can fight for your patch. The local street gang made the mistake of stealing my hog. Probably because of some machismo thing or something. Me and the boys would go over there and teach them a lesson in respect and all. Anyways, then I got to thinking. This would make a good initiation for you. You get my bike back, you can tell Paul he's got his security. <laughs> come on. Come on, come on. Alright, the local gang has stolen Mitch Baker's angel. Hold up behind ammunition in downtown. Okay, well, let's do this. Um, you'll need a fast bike to get an exit to the roof. Alright. So, about to jump from these stairs to the roof on the far side of the road. I see. Ah. Uh, Okay, so we need a fast bike. Will these bikes not do? Um, preferably have a PCJ, but if I can't find anything, then maybe this will do. Oh, he's got a Sanchez, isn't he? Yeah, it was just copying me. <laughs> Why are you doing this? Oh, kiddo, right, well, let's give it a whirl. We need a way to actually get to the area first. Let's not take any wrong turns. That would be a bad idea. It's quite hard to slow down and control this vehicle. I'm not going to lie. Mind you, it is on grass. It's just kind of a thing. Where am I going here? I'm not doing too well. I'm never going to get that bike back. Alright. <laughs> Alright, so much for blasting three missions at a very quick pace. Doesn't appear to be working too well for me. Alright, let's try this way. Ah, yes, this is the road. Oh, oh, he's got a PCJ. That might do. That's the fastest back in the game, anyway, so. I don't see how anything else is going to suffice. That's right, we already have this sun jump, so it's cool. Get the angel and get out of there. Where is the angel? How am I supposed to get to it? Uh, ah. Down the staircase, I imagine. You've been spotted. By who? You're spotting me. Hey, that was a bit of a delay, I thought. Might be relatively scot free. They're not going to take off on the bike and they're going to have to chase them, though, am I? I assume they're just going to be infinitely coming out of there, so... 
Let's find a way out. Uh. Oh, hey! Look at that. Alright. As long as they're not chasing us, we might have just done it. It's a little too easy, though, I have to admit. Uh. No, it doesn't look like anyone's chasing us. So I might just have done this. Hey, yeah, look at that. Uh, oh, well that was it. Tommy Two Wheels. Yeah, that's right. Alright, <laughs> good. I just thought someone had just carjacked me. I was going to have to chase it again. Alright, very good. And so that's the end of Big Mitch, obviously, as insinuated by the achievement. So we're going to head back to Love Fist. There's more missions for them. So the next one is Psycho Killer. Hmm. Muy interessante. Uh, I'm going to save up, first of all, and pick up our armor just because we're right here. We may as well. So. Uh, just grab some. Uh, oh, hello. Hey, it's Mitch. You did good, Tommy. It's good to have the old girl back. You tell Kent Paul he'll get his security for the gig. You have my word on that. Now keep yourself out of trouble. All right. Good stuff. Uh, just pick up some armor. See, pistols, sniper, and rocket. All right. Good stuff. Good to go. Let's just um we're saving over here. Uh rest with the best it's death row that we're saving over. Yes. It's mad, doesn't it feel that long ago since we did that mission, <laughs> so and yet we've been over so many episodes since then. It's crazy. Oh hey, don't, 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 don't even try it. Alright, so let us start at the next one. Psycho Killer. Tommy, man, am I glad to see you. What's going on? Bad vibes, Tommy. I am knee joking again. It is heavy stuff, man. Heavy gun. This cat, we hardly know him, but he knows us. Like this cat, knows all about us. Knows that Willie likes his ladies' underwear, eh? Or that Percy likes to do that. Shut up, you fool. Just get eh? Jez bomb yeah. sheet. It's a love rocket thing, can. Oi, <laughs> shut yeah, up. Yeah, a love rocket <laughs> thing, right? But listen, this cat. The, the guy he wants love fist dead. Dead, Tommy. Love fist gone. You know what they say, the good die young, but Tommy, you've got to save Love We've Fist. We've got a signing in two hours, and I think... Yeah, and, and the boys think the stalker's going to try some monkey business there. Well, we can't have that, can we? Drive the limo to the signing event and try to draw the psycho out. Um, okay. This is going to be the weirdest cutscene in gaming history. <laughs> it didn't even look remotely like a girl, but... Oh well. Oh. Dude, use your indicators. <laughs> um. Right, I'm going to have to bash this guy about. Oh, whoa! No. Hey! No. Oh, that was easy. <laughs> Alright, awesome. Well, that was nice and quick. Not the bene. Alright, very good. Alright. <laughs> Just about to go down so quickly. Alright guys, we're going to do the final mission for Love Fist now, which is Publicity Tour. 
So let's go ahead and get that started. Tommy! Tommy! Tommy, man, that psycho's back! What's going on? That psycho won't leave Love Fist alone! You didn't kill him, man, and now he's back? Yeah, 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 the thing is... The thing is, we need someone to drive the limo we can trust, because that nutter keeps making threats! Yeah, Michelle, man, I need my mom! We're all breaking ourselves, man! Okay, guys, calm down, I'll handle this. Normally, I wouldn't busy myself with driving around a bunch of drunken Scottish bisexuals. But in your case, I'll make an exception. Okay. At last, man. Time for a well earned drink. Are you being used to a hundred yards to the road, then? Better make it a large one, then. Hey, Tommy, change the tunes, man. I get all confused if my head's not banging. Oh, look! What's this? Hey, Tommy! Take this telephone! Love Fist, your time polluting the airwaves is over. I gave you the chance to be friends. Well, now I'm giving you the chance to die. You try and slow down, your limousine will explode along with your big airy asses. Tommy, pal, you've got to save the band. I'm getting bored of this. Just keep the pedal to the metal. Can we just drive around all day? I would get plenty to drink. The bomb may be an engine. Please stop We're all going to die. I'm going to get pissed. Hey, there's a few here, pal. Hey, man, I'm just near the drinks cabinet. Screw him away. Hey, the vodka bottle's got wires coming out here. That's no vodka. That's boomshine. It's way up to blow. All right, guys, this is take three. This is a very awkward mission. You've basically got to keep driving at a speed that's enough to keep the detonation meter at a, at a minimum for a few minutes. to the venue. Jesus Christ. Alright, we're done with that. That was very, very annoying. <laughs> I'll admit. Is it right at the... St oh, it'll be at the stadium, won't it? Probably. I'd assume. Whatever we're doing now was annoying. Dirt races. Or even that, no. Is it... Is it where we started? Uh... We could stop putting things in the way. It's a good job this bomb's bloody diffused. It's blown up by now. Alright, well. Oh, for goodness sake, after all that, I can't even. I feel we just jump down here. Alright. Just about there. Alright, get out, you stupid groupies. Stupid bloody love fist. Jesus, <laughs> 
the end of the love fist missions so we got a shepherd very nice okay bloody hell i'm glad that mission was over um so we are going to move on to umberto now who i said um that we were going to move on to oh hello hello tommy yeah it's baker just wanted to say i really enjoyed the show me and the boys want to thank you and remind you you got our respect good day keep riding hard son Oh, that's nice. Thank you. Oh, kiddo, right. Uh, definitely making a save after that one. Uh, okay, yeah, so we're going to move on to Umberto and hopefully, by the end of today, get that final shop robbery done, if not by next episode. Because we have three missions for Umberto coming up, and I'm not 100% sure how long or short they are, or if um, any of them will allow us to do that shop robbery so you know the icon might move or something who knows but uh, you may remember that they are the the cuban icon or well, i'm not even sure what icon it is really oh it might be haitian can't remember uh, but yeah we're gonna start up work for them so it's cool be another contact dealt with. No, it never really seems that far away until you actually have to travel all the way there from halfway across the city. Alright. Stop moaning. Oh, t -t 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 nope. Heard about nope. No, no radio. No radio. I said no. Alright. Let's -a go. Stunt boat challenge. Hey, man. Hey, busy puppy. This man's for me. You. You the boy? Oh, yeah. You the boy. I think so, you know. No, I don't think I do. Oh, yeah? You come here, tough guy. You think you'll take me on? You think you'll play stupid with me? No, I think you're playing plenty stupid enough for both of us. Hey, he call you dumb, son. And I call him a little girl, papi. Look at him, all dressed up like that. What is this, ladies' night? You some kind of tough guy? You dress like a woman? You got on panties like a woman too, huh? What do you got against women? You prefer men, big boy? I like women. I like all women. I love my mother, chico. All right, all right, I'll take your word for it. Relax. Can you drive, amigo? Yeah, like a woman. <laughs> Very funny. I like you, big boy. Maybe you can help. Maybe you can prove you're a man, huh? Take out the boat. Show me you got some big cojones. And not some little, very chiquita one. Hey, I'm Rico. You the man with the big cojones? Tommy Versetti. Let's go. Okay, man. Treat her like a woman. Okay. Well, let's do this. Another bloody boat checkpoint race. Amigo, you're the man, man. Thank you. Hey, it's a boat stunt jump. Boat stunt jump. Hey, where's my stun jump complete? That was beautiful. It's not really a stun jump. Oh, hey, hey. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Less of the crashing, more of the going for checkpoints. Oh, there. Yep. Call yourself a man, man? 
come out of a mine, mate? Yes, I do come out of a mine, mate. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, and another one. And another one, just for the sake of it. Alright, hey! Hmm. I am the man with the big cojones. That's my name now. Big Cajoni Vassetti. Hey, whoa. Okay, well, I hate the boats in this game, basically. They are very difficult to control. Shut up. Fuck this bitch. I killed Ricardo Diaz. I own the drugs in this city. I am the big man. I am big man for city. Your boss called me Big Cajones for a reason. <laughs> he knows Big Cajones when he sees them. Alright. I'm a real mate. Yes. Alright. We might actually do this. Now that we got quite a bit of time. This is good news. Alright. Whoa! Ah, no slow down. No epic cutscene. Fine. Fine. All right. Five. Four. Man, you the man, man. <laughs> This guy, these guys are obsessed with cojones, aren't they? Okay. Very nearly done. One more. 30 seconds on the clock. No problemo. Alright, awesome. You got big cojones, <laughs> and once again, for good measure. Are we on the wrong side of the island? Ah, oh, god damn it. <laughs> you never drop me off at least on Vice City East, or Vice City West, whatever. Alright, uh, I need a car that's not a caddy. Oh, hello. Tommy, not dead man been chatting about you, my dear. Thought you might need something to make you feel better, so Auntie Pule make you some stew, eh? Come and check me kitchen sometime, okay, Tommy? All right, and that starts up the missions for Antipole, and I just lost four stars of armor health for no reason whatsoever. Uh, yeah, so Antipole is the last person, the last new person we'll be speaking to anyway, and has his obviously little voodoo icon, and so yeah. Uh, what I'm going to do, guys, because I want to keep this episode, well, not short, but I want to keep the gap of nothing going on short so we can get more missions done is I will see you guys at our next mission for Umberto. Alright guys we're back. Um, now I've been told in the guide that's recommended that you have a forward door vehicle for this so I picked up a Sentinel which was at our um, Sunshine export garage. It's one of the display vehicles there and it was pretty much the only one I could see that had forward doors so yeah. Now let's start at the next mission which is cannon fodder. Papi. Roberto, my son, what happened? Roberto, they messed with me. They messed with me for the last time. What is your problem? We'll take them out. Only we need some backup. I lost a few hermanos already out there. Amigo, you drive good. For a woman, right? This is no time for joking. Come on, drive for me again. Amigo, take my boys over there. When they mess with me, they mess with the biggest boy in town. Okay, get a cab, pick up the keepers from outside Rubina's Cafe. Well, here I am, so there you go. Let's get this d over to with. Like men. men with cojones, perchance. <laughs> that you guys seem to be obsessing over. Little Haiti will be swarming with rubber gangs to try to even the score. Watch your back. Alright. Alright, whatever. Whatever, Trevor. Nothing I can't handle. But where are we going here? Alright, so you see my marker. Let's -a go. Hey, 
All right. Enough messing about. Oh. So, did you ask for a? Pop. Say pop, you pop, okay? Compende. Why am I missing every shot? Oh no! Oh dear, that's not good. Sniper on the roof. They fight like girls. Take cover. <laughs> they have no cojones. We need reinforcements from the cafe. <laughs> this is a very strange cutscene. I must admit. Sniper. Okay. Hello there. Oh, right in the nuts. Right. All right, guys, we're back. Um. Let's see what these guys can get done, because I don't know if we're shooting them. Okay. Fight like men with huge cojones. <laughs> of course, you and your cojones, huh? Okay. All right. Everybody in. Oh no. Okay. That's fine. Right, um, how am I going here? <laughs> I'd like an escape route, please. Everybody out of the way, are you gonna get run over? Oh, no, those guys are the bad guys anyway. That's fine. Okay, let's check this off with uh, Umberto and his little merry men. Sorry, he's these big manly men with big cojones. <laughs> of course, how could I be so. Stupidly mistaken. Oh, nope. Start crashing to everything in sight. Let's get there with the sense of protection and speed. You know how it is. You know how it goes. To dignity. Listen, dude. We're gonna need you to stop doing that. All right. There we go. Burr, 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 indeed. All right. So yeah, then we have one more mission for Umberto, which is a pretty long one, and I think we're fast approaching thirty minutes. So I'm gonna do a quick cut, guys, and I'll see you guys back at the crib. All right, guys. Here we are at the end of the episode. Back at the crib, I've saved up, topped up all our ammo and stuff like that. So let's have a look at stats. Uh, we've got up 3% today. That's not so bad. Uh, so yeah. Um, all we have left, I can confirm, we have one more mission for Umberto. We then have one, two, three missions for Anti Pole. Then another Umberto mission. And then there are the four Vesetti missions. And that is it. So yeah, coming up very close to the end. I'm predicting episode 20. Five will maybe be the finale. So, yeah, slowly creeping up, up on us until we reach San Andreas. But, yeah, that's where we're going to end it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, please sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And also be sure to share the video. I'll see you guys in episode 23. Everything Bye, guys. Changes.